asked the Indian Army to procure one. 400 uncooled thermal imager based drivers night sight DNS with fusion technology for T-90 tank. India is trying to play catch up with China and Pakistan in 24X7 armored warfare. Only half of India's tanks configured for night warfare is against Pakistan's 80% and China's 100%. Night blindness for Indian armored formations will become a thing of the past as the army has revived the process to equip its main battle tank T-90 with high-tech night this year. The army wants to procure one. 400 uncooled thermal imager based drivers night sight DNS with fusion technology for T-90 tank 2. Assist the driver in tank operations at night. Indian Army plans to replace the existing image intensifier sites used in T-90 tanks in the next five years. The proposed DNS will be a form fit replacement for the existing image intensifier sites currently used in T-90 tanks. It should facilitate driving during pitch dark nights with no ambient light. The T-90 tank driver should be able to clearly view the area in front with adequate depth perception while driving over undulating terrain with the help of an uncooled thermal imaging. Site weeds the request for proposal document. The uncooled imager is less expensive and relatively maintenance-free and are used for instant operations. At present there is no Indian company which has the potential of manufacturing even in collaboration a DNS of the type that the Indian Army wishes to purchase. While Defensive Research and Development Organization has developed an uncooled DNS it is not clear if the technology has been shared with any Indian company, says Defense Analyst Brigadier Rahul Bones will retire. DRDO has developed uncooled thermal images based DNS for tanks of range up to 150 meters with field of view 45x34. This will considerably improve the night fighting capability by providing the ability to maneuver on the battlefield under pitch dark conditions, says Bonzel, in November. The Indian Defense Acquisition Council DAC, headed by Defense Minister Manohar Parikar, had cleared a proposal to procure 464 T 90 tanks from Russia at cost of approximately $2. 1 billion. Almost 2. 500 T-72 tanks currently serving the Indian Army need to be replaced by year 2020 but the delay in development of indigenous main battle tank Arjun MK-2 has forced Indian Army to increase its